Nerd Reactor, roll out. What's up, Reactorites? I'm John, and this video is sponsored by Flipstick right here. And uh, this thing is cool. It acts like a kind of like a kickstand. And you can also attach it to the wall like this. And uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty nifty. And so in the recent or the previous Gotham video, I asked you guys, uh, you know, who is your favorite character? And uh, I'm going to choose one person and then you're going to get to win, uh, you know, a bunch of the uh, flip sticks. So the winner of the flip stick is Jessica Rodriguez. Uh, just because I like, I like the answer. It's, uh, uh, you know, my character is Nigma because he has grown so much on the show, changing from the weird, sweet worker to the torn romantic to the split personality to the complex Riddler. Uh, also, every season you feel for his character. I love Corey Michael Smith's take on the character. And so yeah, Jessica, you win. And Gotham, we're gonna check out the uh, newest episode. And in the last episode, it ended with Ra's al Ghul. He sees the future of Gotham burning. So what could this be? Will he be involved in it somehow? And somehow it's gonna change Bruce and maybe perhaps speed up his process of becoming Batman uh, well, we'll find out so yeah let's let's check it out to Jerome. <laughs> to Jerome. Wow. <laughs> uh, drone fans <gasps> Marty Quinn ooh. But you won't believe it. <laughs> oh hey ooh who is this is that Jeremiah's uh, assistant Dig him up. This is so wrong. We got away with worse. Both of us. Yeah. I don't need that crap thrown in my face right now. Get out of here. Hey. Hey. How about you uh, lock yourself up, huh? James. Don't you know, I wish I could let you walk out that door, turn my head. What's holding you back? Oh. You feel the guilt. Sorry to stick my face in your business. Something just came up. Hey. I've already inspected it for booby traps. Uh-oh. I've already sent the invitations. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that. Even in death, he's causing a ruckus. Oh, here comes the loonies. It's a coffin. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's Bruce? Well, he's meeting with Jeremiah about the energy project. Something amiss? Oh. He's meeting with Jeremiah Velasca? Uh-oh. Yes. Oh. Are they using the coffin as a battering ram? Yes, they are. I didn't think you could get the generator program working so quickly. Oh. You ready for a demonstration? It looks normal. It's a giant fly trapper. You kept this project a secret, yes? No one outside of White Industries knows it exists. Uh-oh. Every twisted vision he ever had. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't spend so much time reading it. Jeremiah, it's time for you to come out of this bunker and join the world. Oh, no. Who is that? It's Alfred. She's Alfred. Lunch plans. That was a lie. Uh-oh. You're lying to me, Bruce? Oh, no. Uh-oh. Catwoman? Oh. Um, what the? After Jerome died, he left one last final trap for me. He sprayed me with his insanity gas. Oh, you're coming out, that's good. Good friend, Bruce. Come on, stay friends. This is like Clark Kent and uh, Lex Luthor in Smallville. Where you can make a real difference in this city. You can make up your own rules about how to do it. Hey, 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 hey. No. Here we go. Ooh. Shoot him. Uh-oh. What's in the coffin? They got chainsaws, come on. See this uh, this plan of yours, Jim. Oh, oh no! 
Yeah, no, I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to them. Hey, yeah. man, you like to dance? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, blood. Alfred! Man, what's this plan of yours, Jerome? Still no answer. Hmm. He's got the purple tie. It's crazy that Jerome would have an actual grave. I knew it. He's alive! Jeremiah! Jeremiah, where are you going? If I joined you, you'd find me a cure. And yet... <laughs> One more time, sunshine. Did Jerome leave any other instructions? I'll never... Ooh. Hey. You're gonna start talking. Or I'm gonna stop caring whether you can talk. You got it? <laughs> Secret shot. They're already dead. Oh, who's dead? Jeremiah and Bruce Wayne. Uh -oh. Who's that? Riddler. The Riddler! We're saved! <laughs> How did you get out? Uh, through the old service door. <laughs> Penguin! We're saved! <laughs> <laughs> that one. Jerome. It's like, are you gonna save me? Uh, uh, nope. No, not the drone. Who's next? You ever get tired of me wrong? Lee. It's a madhouse. Tell me again, Bruce. Why'd you really bring me here? Uh-oh. I thought it would help. I was wrong, but we need to leave. Oh. What the hell are you doing? I said turn around! Wow. You, you killed my friend Bruce. Oh, no. Now it's time to put you back in your grave. No. Another clown. Is it Riddler? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, it's just booze. Ow! Bruce? Yeah, sorry, he's not here. You know these ideas are just the insanity guest talking. Oh, a lot is fooling any longer! <gasps> there he is. Uh-oh. What? Uh. What is happening? Huh. So you see, you see it too? See? I wanted to bring you here. Huh. Oh. oh. <laughs> yes. I can see quite clearly where you cut off poor Bruce's face and stitched on your own. Huh. But uh oh. I am a man of science. Uh-oh. So let's have some evidence, huh? Oh, no. Hmm? Oh, hey! Sense at the end. <laughs> oh! Who's that? Oh, oh man. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ow. Ooh. Ooh. Did you kill her? Yep. Oh. Huh. Oh, Jeremiah. Oh. It's Trump! It's Trump is victorious at last! Oh. Ooh. Space. Oh, shit. Long live me. All right. You might as well have sprayed me with water. <laughs> you all need to see Jerome for the utter dud that he was. I would hate to be within a mile of it if it were to overload. Oh. Goodbye. All right, everybody. Listen up. You know what to do. Let's go get our house back. Uh-oh. You gonna blow up? Oh. How did, how is James going to survive that? Don't tell me he's going to hide inside a fridge. You are my very best friend. Aww. <laughs> oh, you guys got it. Uh, there goes that friendship.
Here comes the tear gas. Hey. I like badly. Okay. Oh, hey. Yeah. Yes. Yowza. Don't just wrap me around your finger, Lee. Ooh. That's for taking a leak on my desk. Harvey. <laughs> Found the epicenter of that explosion. It's Jeremiah's bunker. Oh no. That's where Jim was going to look for Bruce. Wayne research. Oh, Mr. Wayne. But I'm not alone. Uh oh. What's with the lighting? Oh, what the hell? Yes. He's got the gloves. He's got his own version of Harley. It's time to give Gotham City its new face. What is it? Oh no! Ooh, look at that. Even the Gotham logo is different. Nice. All right. So the uh, the thing that's supposed to power help power Gotham is now a bomb, and this is very uh, we're very much inspired by the um, the comics where. Uh, something's gonna stop Gotham, or even uh, what is it, The Dark Knight Rises, where uh, you know they have this energy source, and at the end of Dark Knight Rises, the energy source uh, can be turned into a nuclear bomb. Uh, so now we have something similar with this one here, where it's turning into a bomb, and at the end, Jeremiah, aka uh, probably the Joker, uh, sees. Just uh, all of this uh, energy source, uh, so he can just pretty much blow up the entire city with that. And uh, so it's, it's it's a cool reveal for uh, Jeremiah as the Joker with his face turning white. So he was just rubbing off the human makeup, and his actual skin color is now white because of the the gas, uh, you know, Jerome's gas. And so he's been pretty much playing everyone. He pretended to be Jerome in the videos and in the recording and to trick the the followers into following his orders and also to trick James Gordon the the one at the beginning with the Harley Quinn-esque outfit uh, it's perfect by the way it's Echo and uh, so yeah yeah hopefully we get to see more of just Echo and Jeremiah aka possible Joker and maybe we'll find out that you know, Echo has another name, another alias, uh, you know, Harley Quinzel. And I, I, I want to know. I want to know more about her. Yeah. And James Gordon, is he alive or is he dead? Uh, maybe he found, in, uh, you know, a refrigerator and, uh, you know, he's just tucked inside. Uh, so, yeah, we'll just have to wait till the next episode. So, yeah, as for Jeremiah, whether he is influenced by Jerome, uh, most likely he is. Uh, it's just because Bruce... Uh, Bruce is like, oh, you know, you're you're different, or it's still hitting you, and but Jeremiah doesn't think it is, but probably subconsciously he, you know, he thinks he's still Jeremiah, but he's completely different now, uh, especially the way he acts, and uh, it was a great act, uh, just fooling everyone, and uh, his mannerism is different as this version, uh, this version of the Joker. Uh, so he's more calm, he's less zany, he's less mad, and, but he still got his smarts. Uh, so this would be a very interesting take, uh, you know, for just this version. And then, uh, of course, uh, we have the, uh, you know, Riddler. He's trying to free Lee Tompkins. And so that scene underneath the stairs, uh, you know, the Riddler didn't have to do anything. Uh, uh, Lee, just under that the heat of the moment, she just stares at him and she just kisses him and he kisses back and that was lee 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 uh so i kind of like this uh dynamic with uh you know a hashtag ridley and uh, i like to see more of it and just uh, it's like a like a powerful duel uh one's like a super genius and the other one is ruling the narrows and just both of them together it's it's, it's gonna be powerful and then of course we have the penguin and Butch on the sidelines doing nothing, just waiting for the opportune time. And it was just a funny moment where everyone's headed to the GCPD. The crazies are going there because they're being directed by uh, Jerome when actually it was directed by Jeremiah. 
and there's a part where Riddler opens up the uh, prison truck and the prisoners thought that they were going to be rescued, but he just wants to find out how they uh, escaped from the back. And so he closes the door and then Penguin comes later on, opens it, and then the prisoner thought, they were, you know, they're going to be saved by the Penguin. But no, they just needed one guy to help them find information um, uh, about uh, Jerome. And so with the penguin and butch butch is still pissed off and he's still he just uh, he's just mad that penguin hasn't delivered yet he just wants to find a cure he wants to find hugo strain so he can you know, you know turn back to normal and probably get back with tabitha so oh uh, maybe in the next season we'll see hugo strange but one odd thing that i thought uh after you know seeing the uh, the last scene of the previous episode with Raish, uh, seeing the future of Gotham burning. Uh, he was inside Bruce's uh, manor, and that was a that was a cliffhanger. That was where it ended. And then in this episode, uh, we already see Bruce with Jeremiah. So it's like, what happened? Like, does does Raish just walk away? Like, all right, Bruce, I'm done. I'm just gonna just walk outside now. I just wanted to tell you that. That's it. Uh, so that that kind of felt weird, uh, but yeah, now we're here and plans are in motion for Gotham to burn, and it's gonna be a different Gotham. It's uh, I guess I don't know. Once it starts blowing up, maybe the bridges are all cut off. People's gonna be stuck. It's gonna be like the Wild West now, and uh, so that means more crime and. Uh, you know, Bruce, he's just going to have to just hurry it up and just become the Batman we all know and love. Uh, so I'm looking forward to the uh, next two episodes and hopefully, uh, you know, a new season comes out and then we just get to see more craziness. Let me know what you thought about the episode on the comments below. And also, uh, if you want to check out Flipstick, you can check it out in the link in the description. And also, if you haven't yet subscribed to our channel, please do like and share this video also like to thank our patrons on Patreon for helping this channel grow. And, you know, it just helps me to pump out more videos. Yeah, with that said, I'm John, and I'll see you guys next time.